Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Uh, our sister is asking that she's currently going through a civil divorce. And as it stands at the moment, the husband and the wife have agreed to sell the house. There is some form of um, discussion between the two sides as to how the house will be shared. Uh, the wife is suggesting that she has 60% and he has 40 And he is suggesting that it is a 50-50 share. Uh, the sister explains that the house was purchased using his savings and he paid the mortgage and the costs of extending and refurbishing. Um, the sister worked for a couple of years spending money on the family and uh, left after having the second child to make sure that she look, uh, could look after the children. Um, the sister will have to you know, move far away from where they currently are because the money that they will make is not enough to repurchase another house in the same area due to the high costs of the houses. He says that a 50-50 share is fair. And um, what is the um, situation on this? Well, on something like this, um, a negotiation, which is what is happening at the moment, will start with the two sides. And if they can come to an amicable agreement and a 50-50 agreement on something like this, uh, maybe a fair judgment. Uh, you may, you know, some, another person in another situation may want to take this to uh, the non-Muslim courts. And because there's a, a marriage separation, it may just be seen as a 50-50 share anyway. But Islamically, we want to make sure that this is something which is fair to both of you. And if you are both, uh, to, somewhat, you know, to, you know, to some extent, happy, or the accept, maybe happy is a, a strong word, but if you are uh, content with the 50-50 share, then I may suggest that this is uh, a fair agreement that you can come to between yourselves. If it goes to um, beyond this, and I would say that any judgment that needs to be taken, if it if it goes beyond this, that you go through and you take an Islamic, uh, an Islamic uh, process in this, you take an Islamic way of doing it. Don't go to non-Muslims because they may not uh, do things in the correct way. You go to a, a trusted uh, scholar, a trusted judge, to make sure that everybody gets their haq, everybody gets their right, inshaAllah ta'ala. And it is... Unfortunate, but not all marriages, they don't always work out. But as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he tells us uh, in the Qur'an concerning the husbands that you keep your wives in a good way or you separate in also a very, very good way. And if this marriage has come to an end, which it seems that it has, or imminent is coming to an end, that you part ways in a good way and that whatever kind of um, assets that you have that you make sure that you get your right, inshallah ta'ala, and maybe 50-50 is a fair. Uh, if you can both agree on that, then that's fine, according to the Sharia, no problem. And then you can move on with your lives. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you all. Barakallahu feekum. Assalamu alaikum.